Hello, sir. Today I'm here to talk to you about the 10 most popular weapons in the world. Please note that this is not a weapon comparison video. Let's get started. MG42. The MG42 is a German-made machine gun. It started to be produced in 1942. It is one of the most widely used machine guns of the Second World War. The MG42 had a rate of fire of 1,200 to 1,500 rounds per minute. It had a weight of approximately 11.6 kilograms. It used 7.92 millimeter bullets. The muzzle velocity was 740 meters per second. Its effective range was 200 to 2,000 meters. The effective range increases with an optical scope or tripod. Mostly used by soldiers and sometimes mounted on armored vehicles, the MG42 was rarely used as an anti-aircraft gun. It is the machine gun with the fastest rate of fire of the period, also known as Hitler's saw. The MG42 is considered by most war historians to be the best machine gun of the Second World War. Mosin Nagat. The Mosin Nagant is a Soviet Union-made hand-cocked infantry rifle. It was started to be produced in 1891. This rifle, like many other single-shot rifles, was loaded with five rounds in the stock. It was capable of firing 25 to 30 rounds per minute and weighed approximately 4 kilograms. It used 7.62 millimeter bullets. Its muzzle velocity was 780 meters per second. The effective range is 500 to 850 meters, but the effective range increases with an optical scope. It was an indispensable weapon for Soviet soldiers and was often used as a sniper rifle during the war. Often used by partisans, the Mosin Nagant was easy to use and inexpensive to produce, making it one of the most popular and successful weapons of the World War II. Thompson M1A1. The Thompson M1A1 is an American-made machine gun. It started to be produced in 1921. It was used with 20 and 30 round magazines, or drum magazines. It was capable of firing 600 to 700 rounds per minute and weighed about 4.5 kilograms. It used 45 ACP bullets. The muzzle velocity is 285 5 meters per second. Its effective range was 150 meters. During the World War II, it was frequently used by the American and British armies, but it was also appreciated and used by the civilian population. Its use with a drum magazine caused serious damage to the enemy, especially in close-range combat. The Thompson M1A1 met America's machine gun needs to a great extent. It is one of the most iconic weapons of the World War II. Carabiner 98K. The Carabiner 98K is a German-made hand-cocked infantry rifle. It started to be produced in 1935. This rifle, like similar single-shot rifles of the period, was loaded with five rounds in the stock. It was capable of firing 25 to 30 rounds per minute and weighed approximately 3.8 kilograms. It used 7.92 millimeter bullets. Its muzzle velocity was 760 meters per second. The effective range is 500 to 800 meters, but the effective range increases with optical scopes. It was used as the main infantry rifle by the German army during World War II. The rifle served as both an infantry and sniper rifle. The Carabiner 98K was appreciated by German soldiers for its long range, accuracy and reliability. It is one of the most iconic weapons of the war. PPSH-41 The PPSH-41 is a machine gun made in the Soviet Union. It started to be produced in 1941. It was one of the most frequently used machine guns of the Soviet Union during the Second World War. The PPSH-41 had a rate of fire of 1250 rounds per minute. It had a weight of approximately 3.63 kilograms. It used 7.62 millimeter Tokarev bullets. It could be used with a drum and a 30 round magazine. The muzzle velocity was 488 meters per second. The effective range is 150 to 200 meters. This weapon provided Soviet soldiers with effective firepower at close range. It is a very simple and reliable rifle to use. The PPSH-41 became one of the indispensable weapons of the Soviet Union, especially due to its rapid fire and easy transportation. Bren Mk-1 The Bren Mk-1 is a British-made submachine gun. It started to be produced in 1937. This weapon, which attracts attention with its design, 
was used very frequently by the British Army. It was used with 30 round capacity and 100 round capacity magazines. It had a firing rate of 500 to 520 rounds per minute. It weighed approximately 10.3 kilograms. It used 303 British bullets. The muzzle velocity was 743.7 meters per second. Its effective range was 550 meters. It was sometimes mounted on armored vehicles. This weapon became a frequently used weapon of the British Army due to its advantages such as its range and the ability to install high capacity magazines. Lee Enfield, number four, MK1. The Lee Enfield number four, MK1, is a British-made hand-cocked infantry rifle. It was started to be produced in 1939. It was used with 10 round magazines and had a rate of fire of 25 to 30 rounds per minute. It weighed approximately 4.4 kilograms. It used 303 British bullets. The muzzle velocity was 775 meters per second. Its effective range was 503 meters. This weapon, which was developed for many years and had different variations, was used extensively in the Second World War as an infantry rifle of the British Army. DP-28. The DP-28 is a Soviet Union-made submachine gun. It started to be produced in 1928. It was one of the most frequently used weapons of the Soviet Union during the World War II. The DP-28 was similar to the British Bren submachine gun. It used a 47-round magazine and had a rate of fire of 550 to 600 rounds per minute. It weighed approximately 9.12 kilograms. It used 7.62 millimeter bullets. The muzzle velocity was 840 meters per second. The effective range was 800 meters. This weapon was very easy to manufacture and was also resistant to dirt and mud. The M1 Garand is an American-made hand-cocked infantry rifle. It started to be produced in 1934. An eight-round magazine was often used. It was capable of firing 45 rounds per minute and weighed approximately 4.3 kilograms. It used 30 Zo6 Springfield bullets. The muzzle velocity was 853 meters per second. Its effective range is 450 to 500 meters. It was frequently used by American soldiers during the World War II, especially towards the end of the war. When the magazine runs out, the empty canister automatically ejects itself with an automatic sound. One of the most iconic weapons of the World War II. The STG-44 is a German-made assault rifle. It is the world's first assault rifle. It started to be produced in 1943. It was capable of firing 500 to 600 rounds per minute and weighed about 4.6 kilograms. It used 7.92 millimeter bullets. Its muzzle velocity is 685 meters per second. Its effective range was 300 to 600 meters. It is considered one of the most successful weapons of the World War II. This weapon played an important role in the development of modern weapons.